Our last presentation tonight comes in the team category as now we honor our men's track and field team from 1975-76. Long time a powerhouse, the MSU men's track and field team from this season has been identified by many as one of the all-time best teams in the history of the program. And given the fact that MSU has had men's track and field at this institution dating back to 25-26, this statement cannot be dismissed as hyperbole. Boasting tremendous depth, incredibly, MSU won 11 events and placed in 14 individual events as the meet literally turned into a Minnesota State extravaganza and they won the team championship. Led by Peter Pratt's titles in the long jump and triple jump and John Roscoe's unprecedented double in the 880 and 1000, MSU doubled the point total on the second place finishers from North Dakota State, outscoring the vaunted Bison by a 98 to 47 margin. This group of men is probably the greatest team we had at MSU in conference competition, said longtime Maverick coach Chuck Peterson. Northern Iowa, North Dakota, South Dakota State all had strong teams and great athletes at the conference championship. So we knew it was going to be an outstanding meet, but we were completely dominant. You and I was supposed to have a great team. This NCC meet was the first quality meet they had at the Unidome, which had just opened. But it really turned into a no contest. The kids from the Bahamas were great. The reality was that MSU scored points in almost every event. This truly was a great group of quality student athletes. Tonight, young men, you walk and run together again. Please join us as we welcome the men's track and field team from the 1975-76 season into the MSU Athletics Hall of Fame.